One player remains. And what a way to finish it off. That trap didn't slow her down at all. Let's move on to the next arena. We're going to be streaming a new game, and it, it looks pretty awesome, I have to say. I had a quick sneak peek at it last night, and uh, I'm not very good at it, I have to say. Um, but it's uh, it's looking very, very promising. The game is called Darwin Project, and it is a battle royale game where we play in uh, the harsh Canadian winter. <clears throat> it is a future, it's kind of like Hunger Games style, so it's uh, uh, a futuristic scenario, and 10 inmates are placed in the uh, harsh Canadian winter, and where they have to fight each other to the death, um, and also survive out in the cold. So uh, it involves uh, snow boots and uh, uh, fur cloaks. You start off with a bow and arrow, or actually five arrows, and uh, uh, a shovel or something like that, or an axe. And you have to make sure that you get enough wood and enough fur and possibly get your hands on some electronics in order to be able to kill everyone else and be the last prisoner standing. Of course, there's going to be fans all over the world watching you murder each other. So that is the idea. <laughs> and let's go over to Darwin Project. Oh, yes. Um, is this where I want my cam to be? Sure, it'll do. So... I should point out the game is currently in a closed alpha and uh, I was uh, fortunate enough to receive a key uh, from the developers to have a look at this game. Yes, the pleasures of being a YouTuber. Oh yeah. So there's info about the game. You can uh, read that if you want. Um, <clears throat> should point out the game isn't done yet. Um, there are some very interesting features to this. Um, the thing is that you uh, you have uh, tracking uh, abilities, so you can figure out where people are, which is really really cool. Um, you can find clues when they've when they've scavenged for resources. Um, you can uh, detect them from certain areas, and uh, well, you'll see the rest as we go. So <clears throat> here we go, Darwin Project currently in closed alpha. Uh, so you need to light a fire to, in order to stay warm. However, when you do, your fire is going to be visible in the night. Ooh, that's loud. So this is the lobby. We're just waiting. So this is my dude. He, uh, he looks like this. I've got a snow shovel and my bow is actually based on a ski. You can shoot your bow, try and hit people. Um, very very competent with that as you can see so we can run we have a stamina bar so what you see in the bottom left is health uh, in red you see um, my cold meter in blue and my stamina in white we also have a crafting thing armor, fire, arrows. So we need to survive, so we're gonna chop this tree down, get us some wood. You can see the mini-map on the bottom left. You can't see where others are unless you already know it. So we start off in an area with a lot of wood, that's fine. Going to the center is typically dangerous. Let's not start out with that, because we do want to survive. You can shoot deer and such to get leather. Sometimes you'll find an abandoned uh, couch or something, which also has some leather on it. Um, crafting an arrow costs a wood, so just spamming your ammo isn't really going to get you very far if you can... Okay, see there? There's a couch or a dresser. Let's see if there's anyone around. Okay, let's go get us some leather. So this open uh, electronic is available, is but it's really far away. Probably not worth rushing off to get it because someone's bound to be closer. So the electronics are uh, allow you to create some uh, some more high end materials, some high end gear, uh, like um, energy shield, teleport, or camouflage. But of course, let's make, let's make an alliance flag. See if we can actually make some friends. 
So we now have an alliance flag. Get some more leather, shall we? So the, the trick is to stay alive, but you also need to gather resources. Now, as you can see, we actually leave tracks in the snow. Those will light up for other players. Um, so a lot of the game has got, game's design has gone into making sure it's easier to find other players. So that hiding and just surviving by not interacting gets harder. So there's a bunch of ways to figure out where people are, basically. Which is, uh, I think, a decent way to approach the problem of Battle Royale games where people just don't interact. Electronic is this electronic is actually pretty close. Well, let's see if we can't go and snatch us that. Also, speed boots, so we run faster. That seems like a plan. Also, I'm gonna have to eat myself. That's not good, because people will know where I am. I've lit a fire, and I'm now very, very visible. If I stray too much, too far from my fire, I will not be warmed. So, you can see the blue meter going up. It's a bit counterintuitive for blue to indicate warmth instead of cold. I'm not sure how far I can fall without that. Oh, did I see someone? Oh, someone's already grabbing the electronic. Okay, I survived that, so that's good. Someone died, yay! We are not the first one to perish, that's something. How am I doing for resources? Okay, so these cabins... Cabins are actually really nice spots, because they will get you resources if you're the first one to get there. Like this couch. No. Oh. But they'll also tell you where you are and where everyone else is. And that is really, really useful. So you can use it to spy on people. There are two people over there, and a lot of people up north. Uh, who just died? There. So I'm kind of by myself. Eureka-chan is one square to the north. Northeast, can we go there? Yes, we can. A new electronic oh. is available. Well, someone's already really close to that, so that's a problem. Let's make sure we craft us some more stuff. Something to resist cold. And we can't make that because we don't have the letter. So now we have a fur cloak so we get cold a bit more slowly. Which is kind of convenient. Um, heading back this direction now. So it's quite a big map but it'll get smaller over time. You see uh, the map is divided into seven sectors in this nice hexagonal grid thingy. And uh, one by one, the sectors will be made unavailable. Now this game actually has uh, a, uh, a kind of DM mode where you're the show director, because all of this happens, you can see cameras everywhere, right? All of this in the, in the fluff of the thing happens in front of it, an international audience. Um, so you also, level up by gaining fans and um, as the show director you don't participate in the uh, competition instead you are your job is to make it interesting so what you see here happening in the southwest zone is actually something that the show director can make happen okay i'm quite close to the thing and no one's gotten to it yet let's see of course get going to where the electronic is is another way to make sure people interact because everyone starts trying to find the same thingamajig. So it's dangerous here. I don't see anyone, so let's just see if we can go and get it. Everyone will see that I'm getting it now, which is uh, dangerous, and I can't look around as I do this. But I seem to have made it out, so let's get the hell out of here, because this is bound to attract unwanted attention. So now I can build a bunch of stuff. Can I get in here? Is there anything here? Well, I can hide for a moment. Um, so I can build energy shield, invincibility, travel, or Southwest invincibility. So let's build the invincibility thing. Remaining. That seems convenient. And a damage upgrade. Seems nice too. I'm going to need a fire right about now. And need to keep an eye on the windows. No windows, that's convenient. 
I'm not sure how the visibility from the fire works, whether everyone can see you on the map or just they can see the light. Center in which case... Ooh, the center is forbidden. That's interesting. So, fully stocked on heat. No one seems to be on my ass right now. Let's get some more leather. Should have faced the door as I did this. As you can tell, I'm not super experienced in this just yet. The, open, the closed uh, alpha has been going all weekend. And uh, I have about an hour in this game, so many people will have much more time. Oh, let's go hunting. There. So, I, you can see I now have only four arrows left instead of five. But if I manage to make it my way to this deer, I can both loot my own arrow back and get a warm pack. Oh, nice. So that let me, lets me get warm without building a fire if I have to. Center zone is becoming off limits now. Still haven't run into anyone. Yeah. So this constrains the map a lot. So you can see on the map that someone is, uh, something's happening to this electronic. I guess someone's, oh, it was spawning. Okay, that's cool. We're reasonably close. Oh, let's go in this cabin and quickly see whether we're the closest or not. Where's the door? Here's the door. So, are we closest? We are... kind of closest. Take the time to loot the leather. There we go. Uh, oh, yeah, we can sneak out the window here. Let's not keep sneaking, shall we? Arrow kill. Another dead guy, awesome. Players remaining. We're surviving! Look, we're surviving, we're awesome. So whenever you loot something, People, it will leave uh, clues for others to investigate. So, West zone is about to so be people might actually see, okay, someone has been uh, been cutting down trees here, and then if you investigate them, you can actually get an automatic view of where they are. So they'll show as uh, highlights even behind objects for a limited amount of time. So that can be a really good way to sneak up on someone and get an advantage. But of course, not not harvesting stuff isn't really an option because that's how you get better gear, like improving my axe, or making more arrows. We're really close, but so might others be. Mm. I like the, the semi-cartoony style, it's a bit Team Fortress-ish. Right, gotta keep a close eye on whether anyone else is approaching. Let's not dive straight for target. Ah, screw it. I want more electronics. West zone is now forbidden. Four zones remaining. Can I make this? Yes, I can. I've got another electronic. Two of them now, so that should be, provide a bit of an advantage. Do we want more immortality? I guess we do, but let's get away from the obvious spot where I just was. So it's really a game about information. In a large part. Now, I haven't run into anyone yet, so that's good. Let's hide down here. Oh, crap! I hit the wrong button. That was dumb. Ah, oh, that was a waste. I meant to hit Q and I hit R instead. Which means I actually triggered the thing I worked so hard to get. That was dumb. Uh, well, let's go for the stealth thing then. See, that's... Um, <clears throat> Uh, yeah, that was dumb. Did I mention I'm a noob? I'm a noob. Absolutely. If you're cold, cold? You cold is bad. I don't like cold. Let's craft a fire in here. At least I can Excellent. see whatever's out there. Well, of course, if you're not getting kills. Of course, if you're not getting kills, then you're also getting less stuff. And the world is getting smaller and smaller. There's three other players still in the game. And uh, we're going to have to do our best to make sure that we are the last one standing. Of course, with fewer players, the chance of actually being the closest one also improves. 
let's see, how much do I need for another axe? Can I get that? I... Yeah, let's upgrade my axe, shall we? Right, back to where the electronics are. Oh, I've actually, yeah, I've actually got the upgrade permanently. It just uh, has a cooldown. That's cool. Oh, I had no remaining. idea. Hmm. Yeah, so, so far I haven't run into people yet. But uh, I've been fighting the cold and the deer. So G and R for invisibility and invulnerability. Mm -hmm. Thank you for maybe sort of leaving me. How do I get down there? Oh, here, okay. Anyone else coming this way? Probably. Can I jump this? <sighs> uh, apparently I can. Good. That would be a dumb way to go. Anyone else over here? Very, very suspect spot, of course. So... Get this thing in, and that gives me the teleport upgrade, the last one I can get. So we've now got... Oh, I'm tracked, so now someone knows exactly where I am, which means someone's on my trail. Let's uh, craft another arrow while we're at it. And you can see this, uh, this timer thingy going, telling uh, me how long I'm being tracked for. So, back is probably easier. Alright, let's go and get... Oh, oh, oh! The place where I'm at is a bad place now. Uh, in that case, we go this way. And someone knows exactly where I am, and he knows where I have to go. So the chance of running into someone has increased by a lot. I didn't craft my... Uh, my thing I'm a jig yet. Where do we go? Twenty-eight and seven. Still being tracked. A new electronic is available. Seconds. I don't like this. Oh 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 no, don't run into rocks. Rocks slow us down. Twelve, eleven, ten. I'm at nine. I haven't crafted the speed thing yet. Three, two, one. Southeast zone is now forbidden. Two Where zones are... remain. Uh, oh, that was cold. Oh, we're alive. We're not dead yet. And there's three of us left. Where did he die? He died there. Let's keep an eye on there, shall we? Wow, that was close. Uh, craft the last electronic, because why the hell not? Because it lets me travel super fast, and that's quite convenient when you're, for example, in a spot where you need to leave very soon. Well, we've now got only one sector left. Let's see what, what happens when I press F. Oh, I can just pop right over there, okay. That's cool. So now I'm here. That's a decent way to do teleport, I guess. Eighteen. Fifteen. Twelve. Eleven. Oh, there we go. No, that's a forbidden one. Damn it. Need to go the other way. Can I get there? Where can I go? East zone is now forbidden. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Oof. Okay. 
we're still alive. Last zone. Two people left to kill or kill me. Oh, I scared off a deer. Fair enough. I'd be scared too. Uh, can't upgrade anything. Don't have the resources. Who did that? What's happening? I have no clue. Oh, speaking of clues, let's find one. Seven death. I have no clue where I can't see. Uh, I got a heat pack though. No! <sighs> Did I die from freezing? So close! So close! Aww. Well. That's... that's the game? <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't, uh, didn't train anymore. This is, uh... New record! You got a kill for the first time? Yeah, I do like the, uh, I do like the electronics. I guess I should keep a closer eye on my body heat, though. Because I actually had this heat pack and I didn't use it in time. That would have made a difference. Especially because when you get cold, your line of sight also decreases. Thank you. Let's do another one. This one. Here we go. Second place isn't bad, no. But if you got to second place, if you got to third place by just running around and happening not to meet anyone, um, then uh, it doesn't feel like that much of an achievement. Although, planning where you go. <laughs> Planning where you go and keeping your uh, your information accurate is, of course, very helpful. Choosing not to go for the central spots when you know you're uh, you're not going to be the one to beat people there. Wait, am I spectating just now? Allez, good luck. I'm spectating. That was not the idea. So let's go out. Hmm, why was I spectating? I didn't click watch, I'm pretty sure. Players, 1 out of 10. Sure. Uh, so, you can choose to beat the show director if you have the right key for it, which currently I don't. No, I don't have the uh, the show director key, so uh, those are uh, those are handed out to a, uh, a smaller percentage of people. No, uh, you don't have to have a GM. You don't have to have a show director. The game runs without one, but when you have one, they can they can choose to uh, spectate everyone. So let's see. So we can craft upgrades to damage, upgrades to cold resistance, upgrade to speed. Uh, oh, I should probably do that sometime as well. Armor. It's expensive, but blocking one attack could be crucial. You can also make traps, which. Uh, are pretty interesting. Not sure what the difference is between bear and cage. Lock down for 20 seconds or immobilize for 10 and kill damage. Okay. So the uh, the alliance flag is something uh, that can make two people uh, act on the same team, which could be uh, could be big, of course. Uh, although I'm not sure whether I should expect anyone to actually choose to be allied. I'm not sure how it works in terms of you plant it and you find it. Oh, I think the game director mode is implemented. I've seen games run with one. Um, so it's just that uh, I didn't get the uh, the uh, Euro GM now key, which allows you to actually act as one. So 
but there's also loot boxes here and there, like up there. I'm not sure how, if I can get there easily, though. And get up here. Ish. That's not where we wanted to go. Falling damage seems to be very, very limited, though. It must be all the snow, I guess. A new electronic is available. So wood is a bit easier to come by than first. Oh, I see a couch already. I think the speed upgrade at the beginning is probably one of the best things you can do. Just because it allows you to gather more as well. So let's go for... Oh, that requires more leather. Fair enough. Someone's already gathering that electronic. So I guess a good way to get a kill would be to wait near the electronic and then headshot the guy collecting it. If you can hide somewhere up there. That's, I'm going to try that next time. So let's have a look at the map. Oh, there's no map in this cabin. Fair enough. Just some leather. Let's get us some shoes. And build a fire while I'm at it. So, yeah, nice halt cabin here. Does the fire burn me? No, I am warmth incarnate. I do not get cold ever. Okay. So, let's go not where we want to go. A new electronic is available. Who was shooting me? Where is he? Someone shot an arrow at me. Now you can actually go and collect the arrows, of course. So let's be completely obvious sitting on a roof. Well, if I can't find the guy who tried to shoot me, let's just collect his arrow at least. Ooh, this looks dangerous. Let's not go down there, shall we? This looks better. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, Canada is known for its huge lava pits, of course. Yeah. I guess if you plant the Alliance flag, someone can just go and find it and then choose to be allied, right? So let's try that. Let's put it somewhere central. There, got it. Somewhere people are likely to go and find it, I suppose. Kill. He's a lumberjack and he's okay. He sleeps all night and he works all day. I cut down trees, I wear high heels, suspenders, and a bell. I wish I was a girly, just like my dear mama. Yeah, people dying left and right, awesome. Just the way we like it. Does this seem like the kind of place people would visit? Let's plant a flag, shall we? Nicely visible. If you want to be my friend, go to this flag. <laughs> and then shoot down people just before they hit it. That would be cool. Alright. Uh, we need some leather, and I see some leather right up there. That's convenient. Let's take this. West and Zone is about to be forbidden. That's none of my concern. Let's see... Fur cloak. And another fire, because we're starting to get cold again. Yes. Oh, I'm being tracked by someone. So let's just hop around the fire with our arrow knocked. There. Who's tracking me and where? So the tracking, you know that it's happening, 
which is uh, kind of weird. But you don't know how long ago uh, you left the tracks that they found. So you don't know if it's someone who's really close or actually someone who's halfway across the map, Hello, I guess. guys. Do you speak French? Uh, preferably not. West zone is now forbidden. Six zones so remain. More, more leather would be very, very nice. Hey, someone left an arrow. There we go. Wow, I'm looking through bushes. That's uh, inconvenient. Hey, okay, let's go and track someone. That seems uh, seems like fun. Someone built a fire here three minutes ago. See, so you leave these tracks for a long time, and they keep telling you for a while where the person is. 250 meters. Right. So I know he's up there right now. Oh, ran too long. And see here we have tracks, so we know someone ran there. Someone ran this way. So yeah, we're hot on his heels now. Oh, I'm allied. Sylvia! Sylvia, you're awesome. Let's go and track the guy again, because he did something here. He's now over there. That's pretty far away. Of course, he knows he's being tracked, but he doesn't know whether I'm actually acting on the information I have or just playing with them, basically. Stuffs. An axe sharpener. Does that automatically work? I guess so. So our melee weapon just got better. And finally we A have some more. Is oh wait, that was not. There. Let's go and hunt some more. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, okay. For, for a moment, I thought. So, you can ally, but you can't win together, so it only works in the early phases, I guess. Because in the end, there can be only one. You can't win as an ally team, even though you can only ally with one person. All right, so that didn't really do much. Whoops. the alliance does is uh, it means that you both uh, won't hit each other at all. Arrow kill. <clears throat> Four players uh, I think you can also see where you are but I'm not entirely sure. Basically it, it suggests we're gonna work together until there's only two of us I guess. I mean you can actually find each other and do do actual active co-op hunting but I think you cannot win together. I'm not 100% sure. So now that we're dead, we can actually see where everyone is and how they're interacting. So a lot of people are pretty close together, actually. All hunting around the same area. This is Sylvia, my uh, my former ally, back from when I was still alive. Yeah, if you're if you're acti actively co-op hunting each other, that's uh, that's definitely beneficial. You can actually uh, you can actually leave tracks and and lure someone somewhere, 
Uh, I think it's it's uh, it's a really fun way to play. So it, it prevents uh, um, hitting allied players for one thing, and uh, I guess if you're if you're actually actively co-oping with someone, um, it can be a lot of fun to, to actually play as a duo as well. Southeast zone is now. But you can only have one ally at a time. Zones remaining. It wouldn't be wouldn't be a bad design design decision if they said uh, you could win as a duo as well. Northwest zone is about right. to be forbidden. Let's do one more, shall we? Oh no, that's not where we want it to be. Main menu, yes, I am sure. Very very sure. Let's see. EU server. This one's full. This one's getting started. So obviously the game is still very much under development, but I do think it looks um, it looks pretty promising. It does have a nice feel to it when you're uh, when you're not just trying to survive in the battle royale thing, but you also actively need to make sure you survive the winter the winter terrain basically. The first to die will be the first to be forgotten. The first to die will be the first to be forgotten. Yeah, there's some some fun uh, fun stuff in here. Oh, now I'm up here! Yay! Mais tu 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 me dis de ah non mais tu me dis de rejoindre une, un serveur et tu trop. <laughs> Apparently, Euro servers are very French heavy. Yeah, a lot of French people around here. And so this is the lobby where you just sit and wait. Okay, survive indeed. That is our mission. Not dying is an achievement. In case, you're, in case you're wondering, there is no uh, UE information in the top left corner of the game, which is why that's where the camera is. Whee! That looks like a long drop, but long drops are not much of a problem here. I wonder if there's any falling damage. I haven't encountered any yet. Oh yeah, couches. All the couches. <sighs> okay, that jump was possible, apparently. Wait, I'm spawning on an electronic, pretty much. That's awfully convenient. Can I jump this? I think so. Yes, even without jumping, apparently. So let's go and get that electronic, shall we? I'm uh, fairly confident I'm the first one here. Or we go and find a nice, convenient spot to headshot the person going to get the electronic. That would be cool. Can we... Arrow kill. Yeah, I'm thinking about the same. Wanna team up? I had the same idea. Do you wanna team up, bro? No, bro, let's team up. Okay, that's fine. Headshot. Wait. Speaking is automatically on? That's retarded. I'm fucking streaming here. Oh, you're streaming. What the? Why? <laughs> why is... I'm stream. Uh, no, I'm not streaming. What the fuck? Why would Why would you want to auto capture voice? That's. Just <laughs> can you turn that off? Yeah, wanna team up? We We can yeah, team sure. up. Yeah. Uh, sure. Okay, follow me. Stay there. Stay there. <laughs> I don't kill you. No, why are you killing me? Who are you talking to? There's more of us. Oh here. no no, there's yeah yeah okay. okay <laughs> fuck, <laughs> fucking China. Let's kill the third one. Uh, where is the streaming guy? I want to team with you. You're a nice guy. <laughs> the third guy is not nice. <laughs> he deserves to die. All right. Um, to team up, you need to create craft a flag, right? Yeah. That's the this thing. This is you. Yeah, you're the friendly one. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. cover me. Cover me. <laughs> yeah, you go make the flag. I'll. Uh, I got your back. <laughs> okay. What's your name on the stream? Oh, someone oh. shot me! Okay. Oh, I died! I died! Oh. oh my god, okay, I will revenge you, I will revenge you, this guy is not nice. 
Where are you, bro? Uh, dead. Coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay. this is a ninja! That guy is a fucking ninja. Hey, I got killed. You got killed? Yeah. Remaining. Good okay. Fight, though. The fact that people hear you talk automatically is a really, really shitty thing to do when you're also streaming. Wow. I mean, that, that's, um... <laughs> well, they said don't grow cold. Let's see if we can turn that off. Sound, game volume, controls. Yada, 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 yada. Vocal, toggle microphone, tab. Okay, can I see whether it's currently on or off? Tab, nothing's happening. Tab, nothing's happening. Let's try that again, shall we? So it's a toggle and not a uh, a press to talk. I would I would think push to talk makes a lot more sense. But good to know. Good to know. <clears throat> the match is about to begin. I'm spectating an RI. Yep. Let's not do that. Hello, the Lord. This is Darwin Project. It is uh, in a closed alpha for just this weekend. It's a battle royale where you have to survive the harsh Canadian winter as well as nine other inmates set loose to fight each other to the death. I did check option sound before going in game. I saw microphone and tab, so I figured, okay, tab is uh, push to talk because push to talk would make sense. Toggle, not so much, especially if you don't see it. Hello, can you guys hear me? Yeah, loud and clear. Okay, that's good. And now you can't. Awesome. You have a nice voice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My voice is kind of shitty. Well, I wouldn't have said so. <laughs> okay. On ta caméra. Yes. I use my voice to compensate for how much I suck at this game. Is about to begin. I think I've made one one kill in six games or something. Guys, guys, don't forget to disable your voice using. The, the tab button. Yeah, that's what got me last round. <laughs> because last match, last match, a streamer was fucking with uh, his people yeah, that, and that he was, was saying... Oh, that was, that was you! Okay, yes. this time let's team up. <laughs> and I'll kill you again. <laughs> oh, you yeah, killed up? Okay, so uh, apparently in the top right, there's this cute little uh, speaker icon, which tells you whether you're broadcasting your voice or not. Wow, that's a lot of snow. Jesus. And so we learn. See a crate I like. That's a crate, right? A that new is a crate. electronic is available. Ooh, damage upgrade, awesome. That tree was a lot lower than I expected. Ah, oh, and this snow. Jeez. 
Jesus. I don't like Canada. Well, I do, actually. I was there once, and I enjoyed a lot. But uh, I don't like the snow. Let's just leave it at that. Yeah, your equipment is determined by what you choose to make out of leather and uh, wood. So it's definitely not a... Uh, let's see if we can find the right loot. Approach. Right, snow boots. We don't need that thingy just yet. And let's say we team up with someone at some point and be the uh, the kind one who offers this. Ooh, there's a cave. There must be a uh, ton of loot behind here, right? That's how this works. So yeah, I've got a snow shovel and a ski. Well, leather's nice, I guess. We can call that a ton of loot if we're uh, feeling generous. More... More of this. <laughs> Indeed, why can't we just go to the Bahamas and do this? You know? Cocktails and handgun duels. Sounds like a plan, right? So I... A new electronic. Not too far. Oh, and we have a map. Where are we? Where's everyone else? There's someone right over yonder. Let's go kill them. First, let's build a fire. Because we are cold and don't freeze to death is good advice. Uh, since we don't have that much melee, let's make a trap, shall we? Hmm... Because I suck at aiming, so a trap seems like a good idea. They were this way, right? Now, if I were... If I were super patient, I could just put the trap just inside the house. Or maybe in high snows or something. Mine. Got my arrow back. Got my stuffs. The problem is that being super patient, it doesn't pay off because you don't get the uh, the upgrades you want. Uh, I've already been here. Let's not go here. It is a silly place. Headshot. Going where the trees aren't is costly. A new is available. That's not a person. Let's go track someone, shall we? Someone's over there. That's not too far. We can... Yeah, why don't we not turn my monitor off, shall we? Ah, the person I was tracking died, not the other guy. That's too bad. Someone must be nearby still, though. Lots of arrowheads lying around. Well, don't mind if I do. Right? Five players remaining. More axe. Southwest zone is now forbidden. Six zones remain.
Northwest zone is about to be forbidden. Make a fire, draw some attention. Because we've got a trap. Let's see if he falls into my trap, that would be awesome. I kind of want to track him again, so let's go to where I know he was just now. And now we've got his location. That's a bit far. Too bad about the trap then. Not too far. Can't manage that. The problem, of course, with running after someone. Let's keep tracking him at least. Northwest zone is now forbidden. Five so there's a kind of a balance remaining. here, really. Because as long as you're tracking someone, you're not getting resources and they are. But they can't figure out where you are and you can figure out where they are. So there's. Yeah, of course, what you do is you leave the traps when you're getting tracked. So let's not follow directly in his footsteps. Oh, he was behind the hill and not in front of it. That sucks. Oh, don't, don't. Don't do that. Now I got a headshot at it while jumping. That's impressive. Where's the guy? No, oh, where did he go? Ah, oh, headshot it again. But I did do a lot of damage, I suppose. That's less than one person's hit points worth. 22% accuracy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. There's a reason I mostly play turn-based games. <laughs> but it is enjoyable, even if I suck. Let's see, can I make this? Am I now number 10? The match yeah. I'm not two hours in yet. I didn't make it in, so never mind. I remember the time I tried to play Overwatch. I wasn't awful at it, though. It was better at Team Fortress once. Uh, yeah. There are videos of that. Yes, uh, Cuthbert. If you just search on my YouTube channel, you will definitely, definitely find them. Couple of full games, couple of highlights. Yes. They're they're also very, very beardless videos. Well, oh, have a good game, everyone. See, I can't even hit the guy when he's standing still. What the? F there we go. Yeah, I always start off on the assumption that I won't spawn near anyone. And if I designed this game, I wouldn't. But I haven't actually... I don't actually know if that's the case. So it might very well be that you start on the map and then get shot in the back. Yeah, the beard feels feels part of me. Absolutely, I agree. Okay, 
let's go and get some info in here. Oh, look at that. We can jump through the windows. Let's go. Okay, we're quite close to a bunch of other people, so let's not... ...for too long. Of course, we can see them coming, so that a helps. A electronic is available. Two leather. That's good. That's really good. And speed. And damage. And let's look at the map while we sit at our fire, because that way we know if someone's coming. Right, that makes sense. Two people relatively close by. Those guys are fighting over there. Let's go there. Let's go find the guy who survives that fight. Oh, tree. Might as well. Hey, there's a tree down there. Let's go and get it. Yes. Axe kill. Dave Fuckface. He sounds like a nice guy. No, I did not jump onto the roof. Oh, kind of did. Right. First, let's look at the map. Uh, that's pretty close, actually. That's pretty fucking close. As in, right through the drawer, close. Oh, and someone's tracking me, so they know where I'm hiding. Okay, well, let's get some stuff anyway. Because we can't sit around all day. Right. A trap while we're being tracked. That sounds like a splendid idea. And we are no longer tracked. Is he still here? Oh, they're both here. There's two people here now. Scary, scary stuff. Yeah, cameras are always watching. Still here? Uh, seems to be moving away a little. Which one am I? I'm that one. Okay. Well, can I collect the trap again? I can collect my trap again. That's cool. Okay, that's a really nice feature, actually. Mm. Let's go find them. Thinking they could track me. Well, actually, since I spent some time doing bullshit, let's gather some more trees, then go back into our ca cabin where we can see who's doing what, and set a fire. Because in the cabin you know you're pretty safe, because you know that no one's near, or when they are, at least you'll know there are. So we lay a trap, and then we set a fire, like here. And now we use our fire while hopefully triggering this trap. Nah, they're not that close, are they? Wait, there's actually two of them, right? Oh, I suck at this orientation thing. Oh, they're really close. They're really close. They're probably not entering through the door, at least I wouldn't. Kill. That guy's dead, though. heard footsteps. Damn it. Did I just kill him with my trap? No, I did not. Oh, damn it. Oh. Yeah, so if you want to do this thing, then you should probably have a bunch of traps so that you can put one at each door and at the window, and then go and camp. That works. That works. One more. It's 12.37. One more. Hiya, Zunk. There we go. 
The trap does stop your opponent. There's two different kinds of traps. One deals uh, damage and immobilizes for 10 seconds, and the other just immobilizes, or at least keeps from, from moving, but uh, in a different way, for 20 seconds, I think. Or at least the description said it would. <clears throat> but it could have been me moving away from him instead of the other way around. But I didn't see him in the trap. Yeah. If you somehow win without killing anyone, you will leave presents and your body put on display in a museum. If you are somehow killed, uh, if you somehow win without killing anyone, your your body will be frozen and stored in a museum. Now that's uh, that's uh, encouraging, right? So, Zunk, this game is a battle royale where um, you have to live outside. You start off with, in this case, a snow shovel and a ski-based um, bow and arrow. And you need to survive winter in Canada while uh, nine other inmates try and make sure they're the one who survives by killing you. Hey, this is Sylvia. Sylvia, my former buddy. There's also a lot of tracking features to make sure people uh, are forced to interact a little bit. Or does it say Silvio? It says Silvio, doesn't it? Well, that's a good way to uh, alienate someone. It's Sylvia! To be fair, the font is very squarish. Yay! Thanks for the lift! The following decisions are not acceptable reasons for withdrawing from the Darwin Park. Nervousness, colon blindness, spastic spleen disorder, hypertension, high blood pressure, fear of heights, agoraphobia, diarrhea, camera shyness, involuntary screaming, or prior engagements. Involuntary screaming. Okay, cool. Survive! Let's survive. Yeah, gamer girls are a myth, absolutely, Caffeine Princess. Especially when they call themselves with a very girly name like Princess, then you know that they're barley guys, right? Seems to have used up my stamina there. Of course, jumping uses it too. Allegedly, uh, Alvar. Allegedly. Headshot. Is close? No one's really close. Okay, let's go some leather. Yeah, I'm definitely not making that flag again. A new electronic is available. Right, let's get us some boots. And oh, we're out of leather again. I thought I had a lot. Oh, whatever. Axe kill. We're not quite cold yet. Do we want to craft a trap? I kind of like the trap idea. So this one's supposed to immobilize for 10 and damage. This one locked down. Let's try this one, see what it does. Also not sure how visible it's going to be. And since we now know that we can collect our traps again, let's just test it out and see how it looks. So, two, now there's a trap here. Okay, that's, uh, that's interesting. Ah, so they're not able to move out of this thing. But they're still going to be able to move around within it. That makes sense. So I like the bear trap better, I think. Look at the map. Anyone on me? Not at all. Okay, so we can safely go and collect some things. Speed boots, that's nice, I guess. I mean, speed's pretty important for a bunch of stuff. Everyone needs their amphetamines every now and then. And doo -doo -doo, where do we go? Where do we go now? Okay, uh, obviously we're making a fire in the cabin where we know we're safe. Because then we'll know if we're not. Yeah, are we? 
Are we? We are very, very safe. So we're building a fire. Let's not get cold. Also, let's not get cold in the near future because we've got a cloak. Yeah, look at that. I feel like such a hunter already. Keep an eye on the map. Someone is heading my way, but he's not quite here yet. So let's go here and wait for him. Yeah, that's how you spot a fire, right? That's kind of cool. Oh. Where'd he go? Oh, he's going to track me in. Did he just destroy my trap? Is that a thing? Because if it is, I don't like traps nearly as much anymore. Where did he go now? Headshot. He knows exactly where I am, of course. Arrow kill. Of course, you can look around corners, which makes this rather dull. Let's craft us. Uh, oh, no weapons, okay. How are we doing for arrows? Four. Southeast zone is about to be forbidden. Well, if you know where I am, then I want to know where you are. Uh, now we know, and knowing is half the battle. Are we still tracked? Oh, well, we don't need to be tracked, because we know exactly where we are. No, there's two of them. I broke his armor at least, but where, where the fuck am I being shot from? Where are they? Where are they? Ah, uh, there's two of them. Ah. Uh, as if one on one wasn't hard enough. Arrow kill. Six players remaining. They can chop down the cage trap, but not the bear trap? Okay. Ah, you mean when it triggers, they can chop it down? Alright, fair enough. Ah, one more. The match is about to begin. There is not supposed to be any food in the arena. If you find something that appears to be food, please contact a complaint room. <laughs> Nice. Apparently you can uh, uh, slap arrows out of the air. That's kind of cool. So I guess the markings are just the spots where the electronics can appear. That would make sense. So hanging around one of those might be beneficial. Report stacks, yeah, exactly. To 
to be fair, they haven't looked exactly edible. Yeah, the thing is that the map is just big enough a new electronic is that you feel, on average, kind of safe, right? It's not like you're walking up to a tree and you're thinking, okay, I'm probably uh, getting tracked. So, we leave the trap here. Oh, too late. We're already found. Timing your shots is apparently a thing. I'm so good at this kind of combat. It's amazing. I'm uh, I'm spectacularly awesome. Look, I've done 150 damage. That's great, right? <laughs> well, at least it was quick. <laughs> That's what she said. <sighs> One more. One more. That's also what she said. <laughs> Right, 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 right. Darwin Project. I do like the little fluff. Oh, 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 <laughs> Hmm. Oh, allies also share clues. That's kind of cool. So if you have uh, if you have an alliance, you also have each other's tracking info. That's actually pretty cool. Hiya, birdie bow. Good luck with that. Yeah, of course, this is a pretty uh, ghostable, uh, snipeable game. Then again, yay, viewers. <laughs> is there any reason not to ally with people? Um, you need to trust them to actually uh, make their flag. Like the guy who was making uh, making the flag earlier. I saw him crafting it, and I was like, I could headshot him right there. Mm, that's the thing. I like how these crates are placed in very, very visible spots. Like, yeah, you can go and get the crate. But there's no way you can go and get the crate and not be spotted while doing so if someone... Ah! How do I get on top? Seriously, what's with all the snow? It's like fucking Canada or something? Oh, wait. Yes, yes it is. Oh, wrong house. Wow, that's uh, surprisingly densely packed for uh, snow on a roof. And we have a bear trap. Well, I liked it better than the other one. Good thing about the snow is, of course, no falling damage. And then someone shot me. Yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's definitely... Uh, oh, uh, we don't jump this way. Apparently. What was that sound? I don't like funky sounds happening out of the blue. They scare me. Okay, arrows are happening. Okay, that sounds, uh... Does the coat get cooler if you upgrade it? I don't know. Uh, let's find out. For science! Which means we're going to need more leather. Well, people seem to be in the habit of dying. And there's our leather. And our arrow back, thank you. Uh, oh, this one costs... Wait, I didn't get leather? Instead I got a second bear trap. Okay, that's interesting. 
I think they're uh, they're actually uh, mechanical uh, things. They're not even supposed to be real animals. Is they're just loot drops on on mechanical legs, which is why you shoot a deer and a bear trap falls out. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the bear thing was just a joke. Although Canada is the only place where I've ever seen bears in the wild. Six players remaining. I'm being tracked. Let's see where they are. Oh, they're quite far away still. So that's nice. Yes, I am cold. Let's do that then. Since I'm being tracked anyway and they're not here right now. Have they found me yet? No, they really, really haven't. So, let's see about that co cloak. Does it look cooler? Nope, it looks exactly the same. Of course, this is an alpha, so it might look cooler later. But for now, it just looks as it looks. I do like this mechanism. Like, there's a fire and you see it from ways away. But of course, you don't see the player, you see the fire itself. So it can be used as a lure as well. Right, so we've got an awesome cloak and we won't have to build fires for a while. But we're still completely devoid of any other kind of upgrade. No, that's not true. We have uh, two bear traps, which means we're kind of pushed into a camping, camping style. Got wood, yes, got plenty of wood, but I need some skin. Come on, give me some... Show me some skin, please. Through the roof, yeah, yeah, you do. And it stays for long, too. I'm assuming that's mine. Well, that sucks for the people there, but that's not me. Ha ha, ha ha ha. Oi, I can walk through here, yes I can. So leather, huh? Leather's kind of awesome. Of course I'm slow, because normally I would want to build the shoes first to gather quicker. I'm not even going to bother walking down for the tree. Four players remaining. Four players remaining? Well, my, my super efficient strategy of happening not to run into someone seems to be paying off. Tracked. Fine. Could be minutes. West zone is now forbidden. Six zones remaining. I hear someone on voice. That's interesting. I can't hide back there. Well, he's going to be gone for a while. Let's collect that trap, shall we? Is he gonna come back for me? I think so. I would. So let's go up here and wait for a while. And again, he's not gonna assume I'm still here. Three players remaining, that's kind of uh, not a lot. And I've actually survived contact with someone which is uh a new yeah. electronic is available this is an interesting way to go oh i made it out yay look at me overcoming hardship 
Hey, that electronics is actually pretty damn close. Let's get one. Uh, loot crate. All right, I'll get that first. Health pack. That sounds convenient. How much does it heal? Oh, someone else beat me to it by a lot, right? That's probably a lot. Yeah, that's too far. Too bad. Too bad. Cabin seems like a useful thing to be in. Oh, not this one though. Ah, yeah. Still this one. More bear traps! We've got, what, four of them now? Five? Five bear traps! Okay, I'm gonna have to just leave these at random now. They might wind up killing someone, I guess. Or I just sit somewhere and camp, I guess. East zone is now forbidden. Four zones remaining. Alright, so... Zone is about to be forbidden. I'm cold. I'm cold. I'm about to die. Because everyone can see right where I am. But at least I'm going to be not cold for a while. Yeah, and they're tracking me. Which is a good reason to just... A new electronic is available. Hang near the fire, I suppose. At least that's where all my traps are. Just traps are pretty much all I have. My fire, my beautiful fire. Where are these guys? Yeah, I keep wasting your arrows. That's cool. I like it. Let's use that health pack, shall we? There we go. Oh, 150. That's not a lot. That's one arrow's worth of damage. Oh, I don't have any more arrows. I need to start collecting the ones that they're dropping. Ouch. My shots are bad. <laughs> At least they're as lousy shots as I am. Trap kill! Trap kill, that's cool. Hey, can I get his stuff now? I guess I can, right? I guess I can. Yeah, I'm camping all right. I'm camping like a madman. And collecting the arrows as well. Let's get some more wood for their fires. Oh, wait, my place is... No, wait, that's not my place. I was looking at the wrong icon. All right. Well, let's not assume that the other guy's also going to come here. So let's collect all of our traps and camp somewhere else. Hmm. I do like tra traps. Is now forbidden. Two zones remaining. Two zones remaining. So no one's getting that electronic. Yeah, so the other guy's going to have a shit ton of upgrades, probably. Yeah. So we're going to the same spots, which is 
convenient if you're a trapper, I guess. Provided I can even get there in time. Usually you can. I'm glad that my trapping thingy worked though. That was kind of cool. Oh, no, don't get stuck in a building. Yeah. So we're going yonder. Electronic spawning in the middle. I'm definitely not going to be the guy to get it. Which a also means... Is available. Wait, didn't I have more traps? Yeah, I guess I used them to kill someone. Fair enough. Two and two. Right. Zone so I need a defensible, defensible area, Final basically. Zone. Oh, tracks. Tracks are good. Tracks are nice. Oh! The other guy's also got a bunch. I will know where I am, right? Sudden death. This guy knows exactly what I'm doing, which is why you're shooting me right now. X sharpener, uh, the X sharpener increases your, uh, <laughs> oh, that was birdie. Well done, dude. Ah. Mm. Oh. Do we do one more? The trap kill was very, very enjoyable, though. Ah, yeah, you're absolutely right. I At some point, I was so focused on surviving the last couple of things that I stopped looking at upgrades even. That was dumb. Because yes, increased damage, increased speed are awesome to have. Oh, I looted the corpse, of course. Yeah, I, I, saw, I knew I had a little leather. And then I looted the corpse the and I didn't check whether I got again. more. Why we are still spectating. Let's not do that. Hmm. Yeah, that would have been uh, that would have been worthwhile. Thank the Lord. Mm, that one's full. This one's not. Yeah, I missed that. I missed that entirely, which was dumb. I saw the uh, the specific items, but not the uh, the resources. But yeah, the last man standing is going to have a lot of everything, provided he actually claims all the corpses. So yeah, keeping an eye on the bottom right thingy at all times is uh, worthwhile. Well done, Birdie. What? Oh, thank you. Thanks. Did you run into the trap? Yep, Dang. that was me. You what? can never have two. Oh, were you the last guy? Unless you have yep. so many. I was the last oh, guy you killed. Dude, I'm sorry about the trap. That was fucking funny. Yeah, <laughs> I laughed too. If your match is broadcast, your family will get paid. 
There's also one that says, uh, your, uh, your offspring can uh, avenge your death in the video game from this, uh, <laughs> series. Which is kind of dark. Yeah, see, you can actually, you can actually shoot the arrows. Nice. The match is about to begin. It's kind of cool that you can shoot the arrows back, though. Yeah, that, that was my thoughts, uh, the Lord. It's funny how cutting down a tree doesn't cost stamina. That seems a bit counter. Ooh! Oh, falling damage, really? Well, that was a first. No, it's not actually damage, because I'm still got I've still got full health. That's weird. Oh, right, there's this thing swarming here. And there's no one really close by. So let's go and collect. Yeah, we got this. Looked like just animation to me. So now everyone knows I was here, so let's not linger. Let's see where they are, whether they're coming for me. Yeah, they are. Let's cheat the FO. Oh yeah, so jumping actually uses a lot of stamina, so let's uh, be aware of that at least. Alright, crafts, upgrades, damage. Cold. And let's go for the invulnerability shot. X kill. And now we get to use it. Yeah, so invulnerability seems like a good shout. Now we got some stuff. Number two. Let's go somewhere. Ah! Am I stuck again? No, no. Vulnerability timer to run out? Yeah. No! No! Oh, you fuck face! Every time you loot tech, everyone sees it. Yeah, but if you if you have a cabin nearby where you can see on the map that people aren't too close, then you can get away with it. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, the invulnerability thing seems pretty, pretty good for... I mean, if someone sees you're invulnerable, they can just run away. But this guy didn't, and that's huge. So, simply making sure you have the invulnerability thing, then... Making sure you only get into fights when it's full, or at least trying to avoid fights. No, nope, that's the US one. Trying to avoid fights when your invulnerability thing is on cooldown. Seems like a sensible idea. Oh, there are some uh, some cosmetic options, but they are very, very limited right now. Actually, I think they might come with, uh, with leveling, I suppose. 
So right now, no beards, no hairs, no faces, no shoes, no cloak. Mm, what's the thing? Armor. I can choose between a wooden bow or a ski-based one. I can choose between a uh, an axe and a snow shovel. And so I figured since all of my gear was red already, I would make at least everything match because you could go for the more classic I'm an inmate type deal. So this would be the default that you spawn in, basically. Yeah, not that much to choose from just yet. Switch to girl soon. Why orange? Uh, because it's uh, the new black, really. Okay, okay. One more, again. <laughs> Dave does have a bit of an unfortunate last name. Absolutely, Sky. The match is about to begin. I guess picking picking a uh, color that's a bit less obvious. Well, everyone gets high lit in red anyway. Did someone just throw a snowball at me? I want to throw snowballs. How do I throw snowballs? Yeah, I, I'm gonna survive in a moment. Now I wanna figure out how to throw a snowball. No, it doesn't say. All right, now I'll survive. It would be cool if you could actually uh, maintain warmth by running at the expense of something. Yeah, to be honest, if this were me, I would have probably made food a thing about. A new electronic is available. We seem to be in a chair heavy zone. Oh wait, no, this is a uh, a loot crate, even better. Oh, it usually is. Speed pack, that's nice. Does that give a momentary speed boost? I guess so. Okay. Speaking of speed, let's boost it. It's a house. I wonder what's inside. It's a trap. Okay, let's see how far am I being tracked from. Oh, I'm in a busy spot. Okay, quick loot. And back the hell out in here. Tracking's gonna last a while. Oh, that was a near miss. That was another miss. Well, at least I've got arrows. See, I'm catching arrows. I'm doing great, aren't I? Yeah, it's quite easy to shoot someone when you know exactly where they are. Ah, like I said. So, that went well, right? I am no longer tracked. I wonder if this tree is, uh... Oh! If you're cold, you can pass the fire. Oh, and I'm cold. And That's another one. Arrow bad time to be cold. That's a very, very bad time to be cold. 
Can't I just run and make myself warm again? No, I cannot. Also, somehow it seems I left my speech thingy on again. That was dumb. Arrow kill. Here, why don't you warm yourself at my fire? If <laughs> you... If, if I'm going to be found anyway, might as well offer someone friendship. Well, it seems no one's looking for me right now. That's good. Can I pick this thing up again? No, I cannot. stuff to craft. I want damage. I need more leather, like always. He's moving. Oh, well, he's not moving, actually. He's just staying there for now. And now we know what he's doing. Did he see this? Is he moving closer? Not right now. That's me moving closer, right? Mm, arrow and speed boots. Oh wait, no, that's just speed boots because I already had the arrow. Duh, it was mine. Southwest zone is about to be forbidden. And we do not care. But right, let's go track the guy. Wow, that's a lot of tracks. And we're getting closer and closer and closer. He seems pretty busy. I guess Any accuracy from this distance is pretty unlikely. Zone is now forbidden. Six zones remain. Let's do this thing, because we really need that. Ah, that was bad. Why don't you craft right in plain sight, dude? That's a brilliant idea. I do like how uh, relatively scarce ammo is. Health, on the other hand, I would have liked to see more of. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> I like it. I will be playing more of it when it comes out. Or before, if where there's more uh, beta and alpha stuff. <sighs> but I am done for tonight. So, guys, uh, thanks for watching. It's uh, it's a very interesting game. I'm curious to see how it will develop, and um, I wouldn't mind playing some more of this. Unfortunately, this uh, this beta is or this alpha, I should say, is only for this weekend. It'll end 6 a.m. my time. See you all tomorrow evening. All right, YouTube. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, remember to leave it a thumbs up at the bottom. And of course, if you'd like to see more videos, do check out the channel and hit subscribe on your top right.